Anxious dogs are definitely one of the harder dogs to read. They're also the most unpredictable when it comes to aggression. I've also seen them dish out some of the most serious aggression that I've seen, aside from territorial dogs. But these dogs can sometimes know no boundaries when it comes to aggression because they're so full of adrenaline all the time. So anxious dogs, usually there is some tail wagging, usually a little lower wagging like this, sometimes maybe even a little higher wagging like this, but it's not usually a robust wag. It's not usually a stiff, methodical wag. It's a wag they're almost not even thinking about, right? It's just the excess adrenaline kind of pumping back and forth, right? So you get these dogs that kind of do this. And sometimes you get anxious dogs that are so stressed out about their environment that their, ta their tail is just hanging there and they're not paying attention to it at all. So again, kind of maybe this, kind of maybe this, uh, maybe in the center a little bit, doesn't necessarily mean a happy dog, right? Doesn't mean any of that doesn't mean necessarily that slow methodical wag where that dog is genuinely creating a premeditated attack. Um, it's not the submissive wag down here unless you have a combination of anxious submissive, which you might have something like that. Um, and it's not usually a tucked tail. Sometimes a tucked tail if you have fear and anxiety in the same component, okay? So with anxious dogs, usually they're a little bit back on their haunches, okay? So it's not quite as forward, it's usually slightly back on their haunches and it's scattered, right? So we can have ears up and scattered and looking and looking, 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 looking. We can even have ears back, scattered and looking, 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 looking. A lot of times the body is trembling as well. Anxious dogs usually have a very wide grin, right? <sighs> Right, and a lot of panting accompanying that wide grin. You very rarely see anxious dogs with a mouth closed. You very rarely um, see anxious dogs with a very rigid body posture. It might be rigid in the sense that they're just convulsing almost, but it's not that stiff, slow rigidness that's not usually happening.